Hey guys, Paul from UltimateFatBurner.com here, and today I'm going to answer the question, what does creatine do? I'm going to keep the answer really simple so it's easy to understand. If you want to get heavily into the science behind creatine, there are plenty of great videos here on YouTube that do that. But in my experience, most people just want the quick and dirty version, okay? And that's what you're going to get here. Back at you in just a couple seconds. Stick around. Don't go anywhere. All right, welcome back. Thanks for sticking around. Okay, so what does creatine do? In a nutshell, what it does is provide a critical source of raw material that your muscles need to create energy. That's it. It's really as simple as that. No need to get complicated or discuss anaerobic glycolysis, adenosine triphosphate, diphosphate, phosphocreatine, or anything else. Bada bing, bada boom. Extra raw material for energy. That's it. The only other thing that's kind of important that you know is that your body makes energy in one of two ways, via an anaerobic process, that is one that does not require oxygen, and an aerobic process, one that does. Creatine provides a raw material necessary to re-energize the anaerobic energy creation process, or in other words, the energy process you use when you lift heavy weights. So this is also why creatine is a great supplement for improving the performance of anaerobic exercises like weightlifting and bodybuilding and powerlifting and so on and why it really doesn't do much of anything for long distance endurance or aerobic training. So to summarize, creatine provides raw material so your muscles can do more work. If they can do more work and you actually do it, you get a greater adaptive response to that work which means more muscle growth all things being equal, by which I mean providing all other elements of your training are effective, like your diet, supplementation, rest, and so on. Simple, right? No need to get complicated. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. I really hope that helps. If it did, it'd be awesome if you gave this video a thumbs up or shared it here on YouTube. And of course, if you have your own comments or experiences that you'd like to share with us, please do leave those below. We'd love to hear from you. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to our channel so you can be updated whenever we post new videos. That would be cool, huh? Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you again real soon.